<laughs> well, good afternoon. I like that. Back by popular demand, and you went James Brown, and you went, who? The hell's he? Um, right, uh, a little bit of strange for you for the next 10 minutes, I hope you don't mind. Uh, what I need is a couple of volunteers, and what I'm particularly looking for are two people who have a good imagination, who don't mind coming up on stage, and one of you will be placed into an uh, open, receptive state, whatever that may mean. So, uh, put your hands up, uh, uh, who, who would like to come up and participate, bearing in mind if nobody puts their hands up, we will be having some quiet time. So, uh, hands up, come on. Who, who should we choose? If you don't put your hand up, I'll just choose you anyway. So, uh, would you do me a favour, sir, would you hold on to that, and I'll come back to that later. Come on, some hands. There's a, there's a very excitable looking chap over there. Uh, up you come, uh, you'll do. And who? This lady here? You too as well, thank you very much. Round of applause for these people. Oh. Up you come, up you come. And your name? Rich. Yep. Nice to meet Rich, have a seat down there, Rich. I'll come back to you in a moment. You're nice and comfortable? Excellent stuff. And where is she? Where is she? Running away from me there. Hello. What's your name? Sarah. Sarah. Nice to meet you, Sarah. Come along and have a sit down over here. Fantastic. Nice and comfortable. Brilliant. Uh, you good, Rich? You stay just there. Now, uncross your legs for me, please. <laughs> it's amazing how easy that is. <laughs> there we are. Right then. Okay, um, are you comfortable there with your legs uncrossed? Good stuff. If you're happy there, that's fine. Um, we are going to use this one hand if you don't mind, but you can leave that one there for dignity purposes. <laughs> Although if the act is shite, move it. Um, so. <laughs> so. <laughs> okay, while you're there, very quickly, um, look at me. Um, think about something solid like wood or metal. What are you thinking about, wood or metal? Yeah, yeah, just think about something solid. Wood, okay. Just think about the way that wood would feel, the, the solidity, the rigidity of wood. And as I'm doing this, just notice the way as I'm tapping your fingers, the fingers start to stiffen up, almost like they're becoming like wood. It's quite weird, isn't it? And that feeling can start to move into the back of the hand as it gets stiffer and stiffer, locking tighter and tighter, completely locking stiffer and stiffer. Notice that the skin on this hand is still quite soft, but up here it's actually starting to change. It's quite weird. It's almost like it's becoming like wood. It's quite weird, yeah? Now that feeling can move up into the forearm and up into the elbow as the entire hand and the arm just starts to get stiffer and stiffer, locking tighter and tighter, stiffer and stiffer, tighter and tighter. Now what, you want you to do, ooh, what I want you to do is just take a deep breath, look at my hand, take a deep breath and just breathe out and relax. That's it. And just as my hand starts to get closer, just notice the way that your eyes can start to feel heavy and tired and relaxed. And just visualize yourself just relaxing even deeper, going to a nice relaxing space. And just close your eyes and just relax and just go all the way down, relaxing deeper and deeper and deeper. And I want you to stay there relaxing. And just notice that every sound you hear will help you relax even further. While I talk to other people, you can just relax and completely go floppy and relax and sink all the way down. And until I come back and talk to you directly, you can just stay relaxed until I ask you otherwise. Wonderful stuff. Thank you very much indeed. Um, what, what I need now, by the way, is I need a control image. I need something to occupy her conscious mind. Uh, sir, what's your name? Sorry? Uh, come up for me, if you wouldn't mind. Um, what I'd like you to do, very simple, is just draw any simple image, whatever you like, random picture, if you could just draw it on there for me. It doesn't really matter what this image, this picture is, it simply just has to uh, occupy her mind. And if, if we've got a camera here, we can just... Oh, she's got her eyes closed. Dun, 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 dun. You all see that? Okay, I'm not sure whether that means anything to anybody, but fair enough. Um, open your eyes, open your eyes. Just look at this for me. Yeah, got that? Burn that image into your mind. You do that for me? Just, just see it clearly? Got an idea? Yeah? Doesn't matter which way around it goes, but you, you've got an idea of what that is, yes? It looks a bit odd, I'm guessing. Okay, that's fine. Um, and if you could look after that for me, and I'll take that. Okay, and just look at my hand, take a deep breath, all the way down. 
relaxing completely, floating and sinking all the way down. Brilliant stuff. And just stay there. Keep saying that image over and over to yourself in your mind or just seeing it clearly, whichever way is best for you, and just continue doing that until I come back to you. Fantastic. Now, what we need to do is uh, introduce a more random element to this. So, how you doing? Nice to meet you, by the way. It's a pleasure. You're looking like you've made an effort today. <laughs> Clearly, they'd agree. Uh, <laughs> What I'm going to do is this. Uh, if I can do this to the camera so it can see. We can get that up. Yeah? What I want you to do is this. I'm going to show you a card. In fact, I'm not going to show you a card. I'm going to take a card. You're either going to say, I want to keep it, or you're going to say, no thanks. If you say, no thanks, I'll show everybody what it is. We can get up there. In this case, it's the Queen of Hearts, I think. Is that? Can you see that? Queen of Hearts, yeah? Okay, and we'll place it down. And the next card, again, you'd say, yes, I want to keep it, or no thanks. And if you say no thanks, I'll show everybody what it is. In this case, it's the king of spades, and uh, we'll place it down. Bearing in mind, I'm only wanting you to choose one card. So don't be here too long. <laughs> so would you like the card, yes or no? no? No, in which case it would be the king of hearts. Can we see that, the king of hearts? Would you like this card? No. In this case, it's the four of diamonds. Four of diamonds, there we are. Would you like this card? You would. Are you absolutely certain it's got to be a free choice? Yep. Do you want to change your mind? Uh, would you do me a favor? Would you um, pop, yeah, hold your hand out flat, place your other hand on top of it, and don't move, not even a muscule. If you'd have chosen the next one, it would have been the uh, nine of clubs, yes, nine of clubs. If you'd have chosen the next one, it would have been the seven of diamonds. Um, the next one would have been the Jack of Spades, uh, the Five of Hearts, uh, the Jack of Clubs. Uh, you get the picture. I mean, genuinely, any card could have been chosen uh, from the deck, yes? Okay, just keep that in your mind. Free choice, we'll come back to you. This is getting very exciting. I can feel the tension building, even in me. Eyes open, look at me. Okay, um, what's your name? Sarah. Sarah. Uh, Sarah um, what is it you're not thinking about right now? You know the feeling you get when you wake up in the morning and you've had a dream, and the more you try and think about the dream, the further from your mind it goes? And the more you try and remember the dream, the further from your mind it goes. It's like a cloud bursting. You know how that feels, don't you? You're feeling it now, aren't you? Yeah. Try and say the, uh, the image and just find it's completely gone. Try and say what you saw, completely goes. And the more you try and think about that image, the more it just completely vanishes from your mind. Try and say it's just gone completely. Any ideas? Nothing? It's weird. Something club. Sorry? Something club. Something club. Yeah. A club, as in a, a, a beating club. A dancing club. I don't know. It's weird, isn't it? Just take a deep breath and all the way down. Deeper, 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 deeper. Uh, so if I take your hand here and just place it onto your head, your mind just allows your hand to glue, lock, stick tighter and tighter, lock, stuck tight. Open your eyes. Open your eyes and just find your hand sticks locked tight to your head. Try and lift your hand and find it sticks and locks tighter and tighter. It's weird, isn't it? <laughs> now, obviously, I can move it. Look, I can move it easily, but if I put it back, it locks a thousand times tighter. Try and move your hand and find you can't. It's weird, isn't it? In the same way that your mind hid that image from you, when, when your hand becomes unstuck from your head, at the very same moment, your name vanishes completely. Just completely and utterly gone. Try and say your name, just find it's gone completely. And the more you try and think about your own name, the more you just find it completely goes. <laughs> but don't worry, it's here, look. Boop, it's back again. What's your name? Sarah. Yeah, <laughs> Sarah. But if I took it, and threw it into the distance. Tell me when it's completely gone. Gone. Try and say your name. <laughs> so I, I'll put it back. Back for good. What's your name? Sarah. Excellent stuff. Sarah, you know uh, a pack of cards. Let's try this. Hopefully your subconscious mind has tuned into this by now. Let's try this. Uh -huh. uh, you know a pack of cards, yes? yes? Just let one pop into your mind. What card are you thinking of? Eight. The. Eight of can you say it loud? Eight of clubs. The eight, eight of, of clubs. clubs. Did that just in your mind? Just Is that pop? Clubs? Is that where you said? Oh, yeah, you said club earlier, didn't you? Yeah. I just out of interest. Sorry, so what, what exactly did you draw? Would you just stand up and. Just the uh, triangle. A triangle with a circle in it. Did everybody get to see that at the beginning on the screen? The triangle and the circle? 
No, no memory at all of that. But you, you have chosen, for some reason, the eight of clubs. The eight of clubs. Richard, would you be absolutely honest and fair in saying that you could have said stop at any stage? I allowed you to change your mind, but you stopped at one card. You saw all the cards before, all the cards after, but you randomly chose one. Uh, Show everybody. The Eight of Clubs. The eight of clubs. <laughs> That's Now, as random as all of that might seem, it wasn't. And the reason it wasn't random is that I knew exactly when he'd say stop. I knew exactly what card you would randomly pick if given the choice of just naming any card out loud. I knew all of this in advance. In fact, I was so certain of it that I made a prediction. Sir, would you stand up for me, please? Would you tear open the envelope? Has anybody tampered with that since you've been with it? Step forward to the stairs, turn and face everybody. Take out of the envelope what you find and show everybody. Ladies and gentlemen, my name's James Brown. Thank you very much indeed. Bless you, off you go. And thank you very much indeed. Enjoy yourself. Enjoy your award ceremony. My name's James, take care, goodbye.